I don't know that. When did that change? This has been uh, an open reception issue right here for quite some time. I'm not sure, but I said it's not the same, so I don't know if it's Okay. So is there a location in this building that I can schedule an appointment with my government employee? Yeah, yeah. Let's see that. Let's see that I'm ADA. Uh, uh, no matter what, I need to talk to a human to schedule an appointment or to receive assistance. Who is representative? I'm a citizen of the city and county of Denver, and I need to talk to get from the general services. It's not your business. That's mine. Yeah, unfortunately, I can't assist. Well, where's the where's the assistance location? Your job as a security contractor is not to assist me with government operations. You're not a government employee. You're a contractor. That's correct. Exactly. So where's the receptionist at? It's in the middle. Nobody was there. Well, we could check right now. Well, great. I'll meet you down there. No, I refuse to get in the elevator with you. Hi. Can you somebody at the receptionist desk? Is anyone here? I'm not the Okay. Do you know when they stop having somebody at the desk like that? Okay. Okay. Let's see. If they can contact someone for us. Okay, and I was on the phone with 311 when you so rudely interrupted me. Well, you call them back, but we'll have to have you be downstairs because you still have to make an appointment. That's fine. Okay. So, I'm also Anya, by the way. Okay, I'm Anya. I'm Brian. Pleasure to meet you. Nice to meet you. What is preventing me from standing on this floor right now, calling 311 like I was, trying to reach somebody? You have to make an appointment first. Who said, where do I get the, uh, where, where, where do I get the information about these policy changes? They should all be online. Everything is posted on the city council. Yeah, that's not an acceptable answer to me. I need that. I need to know where our hard copy is, because there's no content control uh, variations on that document there. Which I was reading when I called 311 to get my information. So. Well, I said you hang out in the lobby area, uh -huh. but here you don't have an appointment. And whenever you got, whenever you came in through screening, 
What did you tell Station A, the ladies that were there? Did you tell them that you have an appointment? I didn't tell them anything. I put my stuff in the basket and walked through. What were you supposed to? Do you have a copy of the post orders before you say anything else? It's on a device, but the post orders are just... In general guidelines that yeah. don't reference anything that happened to Pete. Right. If so, you'd like, we could assist by getting the Denver police detective, who is um, a part of this floor, to come contact you and he can provide you with that information. Sure, if you can't do it, and you'd like the Denver police to give you the information, that's fine. Okay. Can we get Nash to get a DA detective? So you're going to do that on the lobby floor where we're, we're, we're talking down in public? We're going to do that here. I mean, either or. We would like if we could do this civilly down on the Then let's do that. Okay. But you're, you're blocking my, my, my passageway and you're armed. My apologies. So. Your name's Brian? I didn't identify. I'm a good citizen. That's perfect. So, uh, we will stay up here. Well, that's great, but you're obstructing my passageway right now, and I am not walking past you with guns on you. So, if you'll go down so I can push the button. Of course. I'm here. No worries. I totally understand. I am not walking behind you, and I'm not trusting you to walk behind me. I don't like anyone behind me. On eight? Yeah, I was on eight. But if someone's gonna meet me on eight, that's fine. Yes, use the receptionist phone. It wasn't a receptionist phone at eight. There was an emergency phone, just like that one right there. Okay. 